one, I think. Going out alone, taking yourself out on a date is absolutely vital when you are navigating throughout your 20s. You get to go where you want, when you want. Ultimately, you get to learn a lot more about yourself and experience things that you never normally would unless you were alone. Today, I'll be taking you guys vintage shopping with me in Kensington Market. Before we get into that though, I do want to grab a bite to eat because your boy is hungry, so. Plan on getting ramen, Addison ramen to be exact. One of the go-to spots for me. Hi, table for one please. Anywhere, thank you. Uh, I mean, I'm just starting, so I got like 80, like 81 subs, 82 subs. That's sick, bro. Yeah, thank you, bro. What's I'm up? Get into that Yo, you should. Why not? Yeah, I don't know how to do that. Hey, man, sometimes you gotta just go, you know? You go and just do it, right? What's your name, boss? Kipasa. Kipasa? Nice yeah. to meet you, bro. You just... Outside, man. How's it's it the best spot in the city. Hey, you spot. already know, dude. This is one of my favorite spots for ramen, like, too. This one's to twice a week, bro. At least, damn. Yeah, okay, okay. This one is this. Damn. Keep doing the Yo, dude, let me see you on YouTube, man. I'm gonna try my best. Yo, right, yo. take care, man. Yo, yeah, you have Instagram or anything? Yeah, yeah for sure, for sure. Sounds good. That's my boy's birthday. But yeah, man, like I just started on this summer and I'm kind of just saying, fuck it. Like, yeah, I don't really care, right? Because yeah, life's too short, you know what I mean? So. Hey, there you go, there you go. Alright, I'll follow you back, bro. Right, nice meeting you. Take care, right? Peace, easy. Take care. There you go, I'm making connections, guys. Let's see. Oh, I see the Addison original. Yeah, I think I'm ready. Yeah, thank you. Um, can I just get the Addison original, please? Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much. Let's eat. Thank you, take care. I want to record myself paying, but then they just brought the bill to me, so unfortunate. Unable to get that content. But yeah, I just said Norman. Pretty good spot. It's so interesting when people see you record in public because they just stare, I guess. I remember when I wanted to do this video two or three months ago, I ended up like being a chicken, not being able to do it because I was just so scared of what other people think, um, how people will judge me and whatnot. But over time, I guess I'm getting more comfortable in my own skin. I'm learning to just not give a fuck and just do my thing and have more fun with life, you know? Here we are today, Kensington Market, taking you guys vintage shopping with me. I kind of do this um, at least once a month or try to go at least once a month because I do have a clothing addiction. So it's definitely a problem, but it's all good. Can't take your money to the grave, you know? So money is temporary. Swag. It's forever. Not sure if I'm gonna cut that out, but anyways, before we get into the into shopping, I should probably break down the fit. And this is so awkward because someone's taking a photo right there. Oops, sorry. A little fit breakdown for today. Solomon's on feet, XT6, Nike Stussy sweats. Just got the did a review of them on my TikTok, so so follow my TikTok if you don't already. North Face Denali, thrifted this. And then Oakley bag. Have a good day. Thank Take you. care. Okay, well, I didn't have the first stop, unfortunately. That's okay. I usually go around three or four places while I'm thrifting here, so always a vibe here in Kensington. Pretty chill. It's not as busy, I guess, because maybe it's the holidays or uh, maybe it's because it's cold out, but that's not gonna stop me from thrifting, so. Or I don't even know if I consider this thrifting. Maybe it's just vintage shopping because I guess the definition of thrifting is a little different, but next spot on the list. Very people. Let's go. Let's see what's good. Next spot, Vintage Depot. Price here pretty good, I think. How's it going? Hey. Good, good. Is it okay if I record in here? Sorry? Is it okay if I record in here? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect, perfect, thank you. Is there any um, Boxing Day deals or anything? Boxing Week deals? Uh, 
Or no? Bogus Lomo insurance, so buy one, get one half price. Buy one, get one half price? Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Okay, thank you. I hope I find something <laughs> on this video or else it would be kind of a waste, but, well not a waste, but I guess that's how it is with vintage shopping. Yeah, we're really gonna find something, so. Sorry. Seems to be quite the fail. I'm gonna find things, so. Have a good day, guys. Take care. Not too, too crazy there. It's okay. Still got a couple more spots to go. Next spot, Exile. This one, I think, is pretty good. Um, there's a selection, so. Hopefully, I get something here. Hey, how's it going? Good, good. Is it okay if I record in here? Yeah, perfect. Uh, it's for a YouTube video. Yeah, yeah, just like vintage shopping in Kensington, so. I will, exile. Thank you, boss, appreciate it. I do not understand this trend. Not for me. Five? Is it real though? That's a question. I feel like the back is too loud for me though. I guess how much this tea is. Thank you guys. Take care. Okay, well, now it's raining. You kind of want to get a coffee, so. I think it's time for that. It may not be the, the best conditions for doing a vlog, but hey, we're still out here. If you wait for the perfect time, the perfect time will never arrive. Just start. Look at the camera. Good vibes, good vibes. Hi, here I am, Jimmy's coffee. Yeah, okay. Good energy, good vibes. Good vibes. That's good, that's good. Hey, good. cheers man, have a good day. <laughs> Take care. Hi, how you doing? Good. Good. Uh, could I get a, a double espresso, please? Yeah, for sure. Actually, sorry, can you make that a double Americano? Yeah. Perfect, thank you. And can you make that a short, like, so not a much longer? Yeah, sure. So you want it, like, kind of like a, kind of like a long box? Exactly. Perfect. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. How's your day, though? Pretty good. Chilling? It's good, it's good. It, um, the weather is, you know, could be given better, but it's all good. To the next destination. Last spot we're going to, Uncle Vintage. The best spot, in my opinion, for vintage at Kensington Market. People are there pretty chill. Honestly, guys, kind of depressed that I haven't found anything yet. And, you know, this is the day where I have the confidence to take you guys vintage shopping with me. I haven't really found anything. So, hopefully, the last spot will be a banger. We'll see. How's it going? You work here? Yeah, I just started like a couple weeks ago. I work, congrats man. What's your name? Elijah. Elijah Brent. Hello. Nice to meet you. When did you start doing this? Um, I've never like seen someone do this in real life. Really? Damn, that's crazy. Like, yeah. How do you not like get like awkward? Oh dude, I'm like mad scared of like, cause there's so many people that like just look at you and stuff. Yeah. But like obviously I, at the end of the day, like no one's really gonna remember. 
So. No one will remember. People are just going to act weird in the moment. Exactly, exactly. So I'm just going to do my thing and then, you know, if people like it, they do. They don't, they don't. I've always liked What's Uncle uh, Brent PHA. On YouTube? Yeah, Brent space PHA. Damn, bro, you don't have to follow, bro. I, I appreciate oh, that. I appreciate that. This video is actually like my first day in the life kind of video. I usually do like self-help stuff. But yeah, like this whole day, I'm just like, fuck, dude, like, I'm so scared. <laughs> But at the end of the day, like people this is like your you first are time, like with like the whole stick and everything. Uh, no, nah. it's like maybe like third or fourth time. So, okay, but Kensington is just like a busy area. It is, it is. But today's not as bad. Appreciate you, man. Yeah, of course, keep doing your thing. Nice meeting you. Take care. Nothing unfortunately today, but it's all good. It's how it goes with vintage shopping. So. Anyways, of course, of course. Take care, man. Have a good one. Quiet. Unfortunate. We didn't get anything today. That's how it goes. That's how it goes. So, I was actually unable to get anything today, which is a little depressing. I was really hoping I could get something on camera for you guys, but that is how it goes with vintage shopping. Um, you're not always going to find something, so I actually have plenty of things that I want to get on Grailed and Essence. The wish list just keeps piling on, so this means that I can get something else online, <laughs> which I guess maybe I'll do a haul of that sometime. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you guys for tuning in. Today was really nerve-wracking and really, um, really hard for me to get out of my comfort zone and learn how to just do my own thing and vlog and be myself in public while recording and it's so so interesting seeing like all these people just staring at you i don't know obviously they're curious right the thing is with doing this type of stuff even if you do see someone else take out their tripod and start recording you're gonna pay attention to it for like maybe like two seconds and then you're just gonna move on with your life right so that's kind of the perspective that i'm trying to take on that yeah people may be looking at me but at the end of the day as long as they're not bothering me as long as as long as i'm not bothering them it's all good you know what i mean so they're gonna just go on their merry way. Again, thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in to the vlog. I hope it was entertaining. Take yourself out on a date. Be independent. Do your own thing. I think there's so much power with being independent and not really relying on anyone else to do your thing. Like, I respect all the people that go out to the movies alone, to concerts alone, to restaurants alone. Um, because, you know, if you thoroughly enjoy something, just do it you know what i mean like you don't need to wait for a friend or a significant other just to do these things it's fun i don't know it's actually really fun just experiencing life on your own and ultimately you get to know yourself better you get to learn about yourself and grow right so that's the process very thankful for the year 2023 it's the year i did start youtube and i'm actually really enjoying it i'm having a lot of fun with it especially the editing and post process, post production process. I want to do much more with it. And eventually I want to break into being a lifestyle YouTuber. But for me to get into that, I got to go through these tumultuous times, the trial and error of vlogging out in public and letting people stare. So I'm trying to be comfortable with my own fears, right? On that note, I hope you all had a great 2023 again i encourage everyone to just reflect and sit down and take in the events that were really great for you and then taking the events that were really low for you and learn from them that way you can have yourself a better 2024 because yeah we're trying to level up baby anyways peace thank you for tuning in until next time see you in 2024 the content will get much, much better. I promise you.